Knowledge is the only resource that grows when we share it. But sometimes that's not so easy. Why do we sometimes find it so difficult to share our knowledge with others? Why do we know something, but rather struggling to put it into words? This is Michael Polanyi. He was a Hungarian wow. philosopher and sociologist, and he dealt exactly with this question. He recognized that knowledge is not knowledge in itself, but divided it into so-called explicit knowledge and implicit or tacit knowledge. Explicit knowledge is clearly communicated by means of signs, that is, spoken and written language. This explicit knowledge can be coded, that is, translated into signs and then stored, processed and transmitted by any media. Implicit knowledge, on the other hand, is based on our personal experiences, memories and convictions and is close to practical skills. It is very difficult for us to convey this knowledge verbally. Yes. Sometimes we ourselves are not even aware of this knowledge. We know more than we know how to say, says Michael Polanyi. An example. A grandmother can write down a favorite cake recipe for her grandchildren. That is document, the explicit knowledge about it, and yet her cake will probably and apparently inexplicably taste better because she consciously and unconsciously calls up implicit knowledge during baking, for example about how long and how hard the dough has to be kneaded. This implicit experience knowledge is not incorporated into the written baking recipe, the instructions, but maybe it will be conveyed over time when baking together. One goal of knowledge management can be to transfer explicit knowledge, which is still in people's heads, into documentation in order to make it more widely available in the organization and reduce the risk of knowledge loss due to employees leaving. However, knowledge management should not be limited to explicit knowledge, but should also take measures beyond the documentation of knowledge in order to enable the direct sharing of implicit knowledge. Simply explained, explicit knowledge is easy to put into words. Implicit knowledge is not. Therefore, we demonstrate it practically to convey this knowledge or practice it to obtain it. Thank <laughs> you.